Hey yo, what's going on YouTube? It's a boy Lynn Nathaniel. We got a brand new rash video today. What did I tell y'all? What did I tell y'all? I told y'all Drake was not gonna go out sorry like that. A lot of y'all niggas said it was over for Drake, but guess what? That nigga Kendrick capped him on fucking everything. So let's get straight into this and let's listen to this shit so y'all can hear it live. It's currently 3 a.m. right now I'm recording this video. This will be up for you guys tomorrow morning. So I hope y'all enjoy. Make sure to like, share, comment, subscribe because I've been giving y'all all the content on this beef. So let's get straight into this, man. Let's go. Let's go. Ah, Jersey. The Pulitzer Prize winner is definitely spiraling. I got your fucking lines tapped. I swear that I'm dialed in. First, I was a rat, so where's the proof of the trial then? Where the proof? Where's the paperwork of the cabinet is filed in? 1090. <laughs> oh. Jake would have took all the walls down. The streets would have had me hiding out in a small town. My Montreal connects. So, what right there if y'all didn't catch that? Drake was like, you call me a snitch, but where's the proof? Where are the transcripts? All the dudes leaking, all the people who were snitching, they never caught me. If they did catch me, I'd be hiding out in Montreal. Shout out Montreal, that's my gang. Stand up, not far down. The ones that you get in your stories from, they all clowns. all clowns. I am a war general, season in preparation. My jacket is covered in medals, honor and decoration. You waited for this moment, overcome with the desperation. We plotted for a week and then we fed you the information. <laughs> <laughs> Let's finish that bar. Let's finish that bar. I bet he takes it. We thought about giving a fake name or a destination. But you so thirsty, you not concerned with investigation. Ah. Uh, uh. You know what's crazy? I see the comments talking about, is Kendrick Batman with prep time? Is Kendrick Batman with prep time? Drake has another kid? Bro, if y'all think Drake was to fucking already have the Adonis shit and then hide more kids, bro, ain't no fucking way that was possible. Like he said, they planted that shit, sent the rats to Kendrick, and Kendrick ate that shit up like a cheesecake. Mmm. Bad looks for Kendrick. Kendrick, like, in my opinion, Kendrick really has to come with some new shit because he can't, he can't reply to this. This isn't replyable because everything he just said in his last big diss track, it's all being brought to life and it's all cap. So what Kendrick has to do is have another set of shit to come at him with. So let's see what happens, though. Instead, you in that Venice studio, it's a celebration. You got to learn to fact check things and be less impatient. Yeah. Your fans are rejoicing, thinking this is my expiration. But it's not. Even the picture you use, the jokes and the medication. The Maybach glove and the drug he uses for less inflation. Master manipulator, you bit on a speculation. You dumb and reactive, nigga, I'm petty with dedication. What about the bones we dug up in that excavation? And why isn't Whitney denying all of the allegations? Why is she following day free and not... All right. Mr. Morale, you haven't seen the kids in six months. The distance is wild. All right, so we got that too. So like Drake said, um, if you never beat your girl, why is she not defending you? Um, if, if that's really your son, why, you, why is she not following you, but she's following Dave Free? Why is Dave Free under the comments with the kid in it? That's crazy. That's crazy, bro. And then he finished it off with, you haven't seen your kids in six months? Oh, no. So is he a deadbeat father too? Wait a minute. So is Kendrick... Obviously, I'll take this with a grain of salt because we're going to say Kendrick looks capping. Maybe Drake's capping. Maybe Drake has bad sources. But the dead, the deadbeat calling the deadbeat is like... The kettle calling the pan black or whatever the fucking saying is. If Kendrick is also a deadbeat dad... Oh, Lord. It's looking rough for Kendrick, I'll tell you that, bro. And, well, it's not even his damn kid. <laughs> Love this. Let's get negative. Dave leaving heart emojis underneath pics of the child. Speaking of anything with a child, let's get to that now. Mm. This Epstein angle was the shit I expected. TikTok videos you collected and dissected. Instead of being on some disdirect shit, you'd rather fucking grab your pen and misdirect shit. My mom came over today and I was like, Mother I, Mother I, Mother I, wait a second. That's that one record where you say you got molested. Ah, oh, fuck me. I just made the whole connection. Uh, this about to get so depressing. See, I will say, as a Drake fan, as someone who now thinks Drake is winning this beef, I didn't like that. Because it doesn't feel like a diss. It feels like it's just kind of like a... 
it's a trauma. Like, you know, he's, he's trying to snipe out the traumas. You know what I'm saying? Like, he didn't got mentioned the guy that got fucking, well, he said it. I won't repeat it. But that's a little rough, man. Especially in his childhood, too. I don't know. It's a little rough. Let's keep going, though. This is trauma from your own confessions. This when your father leave you home alone with no protection. So neglected. That's why these pedophile raps and shit you so obsessed with is so excessive. They acting like it's so aggressive. But you just never known affection. I don't wanna dish you anymore. This really got me second guessing. Touch my body by Mariah Carey play. You probably start reflecting. I never been with no one <laughs> underage, but now I understand why that's the angle that you really mess with. Just for clarity, I feel disgusted. I'm too respected. If I was fucking young girls, I promise I'd have been arrested. I'm way too famous for the shit you just suggested, but that's not. I, I don't. I don't want to keep pausing, but message. no. Deep I feel like it's just a weird thing. Like I don't know why, because this Millie Bobby Brown thing, people think that Drake's a fucking pedophile. Like I get she was 13, 12 years old, but like, look at the YouTube community. Look at like Bradley Martin, for example. He hangs up with 19 year old kids, 18 year old kids, 17 year old kids, like. Just because you, obviously it's a little weird to be having relationships with people who are that much younger than you, but like, if, bro, if there's no proof of him having any, like, sexual intercourse with them or sexual relationships with them, then, like, what are we really doing here? That's a, because, like, throwing around being a predator and, like, a, a, a rapist and sexual assaulter with no proof is, like, the reason that some girls are scared to come out because they're just going to get clowned for, you know what I'm saying? So we need to chill out with... Saying shit that we don't know yet, don't understand yet, don't have to prove of, you know what I'm saying? But if he is, he is, and I can't fuck with that. I there's about ten things on this point I don't fuck with it, and that is on the top. Pedophilia, R words, sexual assaulters, don't fuck with that shit. And I will never defend it. Like if Dave really fucked your girl and got her pregnant, talk about breeding resentment. Not sure how to ease the sentiment, the shit's too intimate. I'm praying you recover from both incidents, but you a piece of shit, so this shit really no coincidence. Drake is not a name that you gon' see on no sex offender list. Easy does it. You mentioned an A minor, but niggas gotta be sharp and tell the fans who was it. You thought you left D flat, D major. I slit your throat with the razor and do Rick Ross air like that one flat from Malaysia. I'm your baby mama screensaver. Only fucking with Whitney's, not Millie Bobby Browns. I never look twice at no teenager. I'm a fucking hit maker, dog, not a peacemaker. Oh. Yeah, bullets that I'm stuffing in each chamber. Yo ass in extreme danger. Stop buying views and buy comments. You may as well keep the paper. Oh. Shit you about the need for later. I give a fuck about your streaming data. You could drop a hundred more records. I'll see you later. Mm. Yeah, maybe when you meet your maker. I don't want to fight with a woman beater. It feeds your nature. If you still bumping R. Kelly, you could thank the savior. Said if they deleted his music, then your music is going to a hypocrite. I don't understand why these... That is an underrated bar, y'all. Did y'all listen to that? He said, y'all, all y'all who are listening to R. Kelly still, y'all gonna thank Kendrick because he said he was gonna take his music off if they took R. Kelly's music off the label. And if y'all don't know about R. Kelly, that dude's in jail right now. That dude was doing all types of shit with little girls. All types of shit with younger people. All types of weird criminal shit. So Kendrick's damn near a fucking hypocrite. Think about that for 10 seconds, y'all. People praise you, sounding like you sent him commissary when he needs some paper. Album dropping soon, no wonder you turn a clout chase instead of doing hard labor. Couldn't get no views, so he had to I say Dre, nigga. You like Fantasia. Whitney, you can hit me if you need a favor. When I say I hit your back, it's a lot safer. Mm. I promise. Yeah. This shit fire. I'm not gonna lie, this shit was some some good exercise. Like, talk your shit. Know, get the pen work done. That's you crazy. You would be a worthy competitor if I was really a predator and you weren't fucking lying to every blogger and editor. But Petty Drake's the goat, Drake. Is. Petty Drake, the goat, Drake. You definitely got this shit burnt the fuck out though. Like, you got. 10 more records to drop the one before the last one we finessed you into telling a story that doesn't even exist and then you go and drop the west coast one to try and cover that up <laughs> i would like that one that, that, that would be some shit i could dance could have been could have been tripling down on some whole other bullshit but you know at least your fans are getting some raps out of you i'm happy to motivate you i that's one thing you. i will say that this Drake and Kendrick beef has been legendary tracks, bro. Nigga, the last 
the last 30 hours, I've, I've whipped fucking kilometers on kilometers on kilometers. All I've been had in the rotation is Drake's diss tracks and Kendrick diss tracks. These shits are fire. They're all fire. Be, win it or not, I think Drake's winning right once again. We'll see what Kendrick comes back with because he's going to come back with something, obviously. Right now, I think Drake is winning because he just basically this. Um, he just told y'all the last two diss tracks, diss tracks Kendrick dropped were all cap. From what he's saying, of course. Take that with a grain of salt. We're not here to say anyone's always right and someone's always wrong. So Kendrick could come back with some proof and then we're like, oh fuck, here's a different game again. But after right now, I got Drake up. Let's keep going. You back to the game, like, you know, but just let me know when we get into the facts. To the facts. Everything in my shit is facts. Facts. That's what he says. I'm waiting on you to return the favor, like. Facts. That's it, Drake. All right, y'all. So, you know what I'm about to ask y'all, man. You know what I'm about to ask y'all. Is Drake winning the beef? Do you think he caught up in the beef? Do you think Kendrick's going to come back with some something different, some facts, some, some mind-blowing shit? Because that's where we're going to be at now. We're going into the red button territory. Because Drake's still calling him a woman beater. Drake's still saying you're capping. Drake's still saying this about the kid that's fucking Dave Freeze kid, supposedly. So, it's going to get real heated. And I'm here for it. Because I want this shit to continue for weeks, bro. I can't even lie. I want a diss track every day, bro. I can't even lie to y'all. But that's without further ado, I'm going to need y'all to tell me your thoughts. What do you think about this diss track? What do you think about the other diss tracks that we've listened to? And make sure to check out all my other reactions to the diss tracks at the end of the video. And that's going to be it for this one. It's your one and Nathaniel. And I'm going to see you when I see y'all. Peace. Subscribe. Smart.